that's up yo and uh how y'all doing today and uh um here we are getting the second room done you know the first room is almost done we still have uh, some touch-ups uh, to do uh, on the edges of the first room that will work done but we are also uh, getting uh, this room to where uh, the first room is at you know so yeah when we we are going to go back in the first room tomorrow because we're waiting for it to dry out and we'll go back to it tomorrow and start doing those touch up towards uh, all the corners all the four corners of the room because we got to make it look uh, nicer and um the biggest part the part that i'm going to play i'm going to play on is going to start next week uh, because actually next week is when i start uh, decorating at the house you know next week is when i start uh, to come up with uh, colors the type of paint uh, all the decoration that i would want to have in the house uh, that's uh, next week so starting next week i'm going to be uh thinking you know imagination all that stuff i'm going to be uh using my imagination started next week to come up with uh the type of colors uh the type of decoration that i would want to have in the house so all that is going to happen starting uh, next week so there's a lot a lot is going to be uh a lot i'm going to start implementing i think next week if if not it's going to go it's going to be the week after because at the end of this week the house is officially done yeah at the end of this week because at the end of this week uh the windows are going to be in and all the tiles are going to be everywhere so the whole house will be uh, tiled at the end of this week the whole house is going to be tiled the the windows are also going to be in when that happens the house is done the house is completed the, the painting all the decoration that comes next that's something else you know uh, when the tiles are in and the windows are in it means that the home is livable uh, you can actually at that time when that happened at that point you could literally stay in that house and not painted or decorated once the tiles are in the windows are in the house is done it's done and like i said next week is when i do i start uh, thinking using my imagination how i would like uh, to do things how what i would like to do in the living room in the bedroom what kind of paint do i want to have in the bedroom in the living room i mean the bedroom and the living room is going to have the same color it's going to be the same color like that's for sure mm. the outside is going to be different it's going to have its color and the outside is going to have its the inside also is going to have their color you know as my man right there uh, we are almost finishing up uh, the second bedroom you know, second bedroom is being towed 
when that's done uh, tomorrow that's going to dry out and he's going to uh, work all those all the edges all the all the edges all you know all the walls right there uh, all the corners he's going to work all that you know and uh tiling as far as uh, the bedrooms uh, are concerned uh, by tomorrow uh it's going to be all done because uh, uh, like i said he's going to make uh those edges uh those corners and those walls he's going to make them look uh, crisp so uh, uh stay tuned on that and that's going to happen you know tomorrow but uh yeah yeah this is uh this right here is what uh coming to africa is all about you know uh, now like i said uh get you some money uh and i then i said if somebody was selling you a piece of plot for less than uh, four thousand dollars or less uh, whoever that is is desperate and they want to uh, scam you they want to scam you you know a serious uh, life uh, I mean land a uh, discussion starts at three thousand dollars and up you know from, from three thousand dollars going up you are buying a good uh, piece of uh, land you know that won't have you know that won't bring a uh, trouble at your doorsteps uh, later if you were to buy a piece of land for a thousand dollars uh be sure i mean you are going to run into trouble you know somebody's going to show up at your door and ask you what you uh and ask you who gave you permission to build on this flat you know on this plot you know usually they would uh, stop you before you actually start uh, to build uh, if they allow you to build it's going to be a little difficult for them to get that piece of land back uh, why because they will have to uh, get give you back uh, the money that you spent to build uh, your home so for the most part they will stop you uh, even before uh, you start uh, to build they will never allow you to build uh, things uh, get uh, complicated if you build on somebody's uh, land piece of land because uh, the prosecutor and all that I go to ask him if you knew it was your land why did you let him build now you need to compensate him for all the work that he did on your land and if the guy doesn't have the money to compensate you then you would just uh you would uh make an arrangement you know is he's either going to sell you the land legitimately like he's going to sell it legit and you are going to get the right paperwork for it or the next option would be to uh you know uh give you back all the money that you have spent to build a home and he's going to keep that home so they are going to evaluate how much uh, the home cost and whoever came to you know whoever came to reclaim the the land he is going to you know give you uh, the money that you have spent to uh, build the home so that's how it works over here uh, most of the time uh, when you are in land dispute you do make sure that nobody uh, builds anything on it uh, if they did or if they do you would have to compensate them for uh, all the work all the money that they have put in you know so that's that my man in here he's uh he's cleaning up He's cleaning up. Uh, he always does that. Every room that he worked up, he has to clean it. You know, has to clean it. Uh, the cement would actually 
uh, be a problem uh, cleaning it up later so that's why he, he does it right away not that you can't do it afterward you, you actually can't do it after but it's, it's best that you do it uh, now after you have done laying the uh, the towels so he's doing that now so he wouldn't want to uh, uh, work even harder if this thing uh, uh, dry out uh, dry up and harden out you know you got to do that you know and that's what he is doing in the meantime like share subscribe you know and uh, you know stay tuned uh, keep uh, keep watching the channel there's more things to come and like I said I will be uh, going focusing on the lead uh, soon uh, this project is going to be done uh, this week uh, this week is the last week for this project everything that comes after this is simple is simply decoration you know, a decoration painting all that stuff that's you know but the house is done after this week the windows are going to be in the tiles are going to be in and the house is going to be done this week next week is when I start uh, to think about decoration and how how I'm going to decorate the house and the type of paint that I'm going to use like share uh, subscribe and I will talk to you on the next one peace